Finally, all parameters have been set, and we are ready to do the practical test. By clicking on the play button, we can run the test and see what the result of the measurement is. Now, we see the relay picked up and dropped off within the allowed deviation. It is therefore assessed with a green cross. The actual drop-off ratio has also been assessed as passed. After running the test, we can also have a look at the signal view that shows the ramp states with the recorded binary inputs. We can see the ramp starts at 1.44 amps and stops when the relay picks up. After the pickup, the second state begins to ramp down until the relay drops off. The drop-off signal cannot be appreciated at first sight unless we zoom in. Go back to the normal view by optimizing it. Always have a look at this view to check the shape of the ramp and the recorded binary inputs. This is the best way to ensure that the test has been performed correctly.